Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, Fat Boy Snacking here. And today, today, I went to Arby's. That's right. I haven't or I haven't uh, reviewed an Arby's thing yet. You know, now, Arby's is, is is not super far away from my house, but it's on a very, very, very busy road with a lot of assholes who can't drive. So I don't like going down there unless I have to. I had to. So I thought I uh, might as well, you know, uh, stop in. Speaking of assholes who can't drive on that road, there was an asshole who, I had my turn signal on, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was going to the left lane. And I had my turn signal on for a good amount of time, and he just goes, whoop. And I almost turned and merged into him. Fucking dickhead and a... <laughs> There's some old dude in a fucking Miata. Good midlife crisis car right there. <laughs> anyway, enough of me rambling. Now, let's get to the food. I just went standard today. I know, I know Arby has, Arby's has the meats. But, you know what? I just wanted to go with a oop. Good old fashioned. Classic beef and cheddar. I really li I like I like Arby's roast beef. Yes, yeah, I like the cheese. I like the Borgar. Um, I like the horsey sauce. I like the Arby sauce. You better give me some Arby sauce. Oh yeah, and of course I like the curly fries. Ooh. The bag fries. Hmm. We always do a good job with the fries. Well, I guess let's get into it. Oh, it was almost a disaster. And by the way, if that would have fell on the floor, I would not be going out. I'd be picking that bitch up, rubbing all as much dirt off of it as I can, and eating the motherfucker still. That it's not an Arby sandwich without the ugh, fuck. I said it's not an Arby sandwich without the sauce. Yeah. Of course, you balance out the horsey sauce with the Arby sauce. I hope that didn't go in my food. <laughs> oh yeah. Time to take a bite of this bitch. You gotta get the Arby sauce and the horsey sauce in there. Cause you know like, if you ever eat horseradish, it like tears through your nostrils and your sinuses. But you mix it with the Arby sauce. And it creates this sweet, this, this, I don't know how to describe it. Like if you've never had horsey and Arby's together, then like, you gotta try it. I don't know how to describe it other than it's just fucking good. And of course the roast beef and the and the cheese and the bread. Everything about this is, is amazing. Always like Arby's. Ten out of ten. <laughs> you should always order this again and again. And of course, you know. I said how good the come out, goddamn. I said how good like the bag, the bag chip. Bag chip. Bag fries were. You know, you gotta get the good, the good curl. Mm. Always amazing. You know what? Ooh, look at that. Might as well. 
Bottoms up, bitches. Ugh. Now it's a now it's a fucking mess. Mm, 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 mm. My hands are dirty. Mm, 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 mm. It's just so goddamn good. I mean, even with the curly fries and everything else. Kitty, stop! See if she does. Stop it. Bad kitty. Tearing up the damn leather. Fucking. Of course, I got a Coca Cola to drink, too. So if you like the meats, you like some good ass fries, you like pretty much everything, go to Arby's. Arby's gets the 10 out of 10. I will eat there again, probably do another review there again. Eventually. I don't know.